So, uh, then you say Om Narayana Namaha and the take a uh, one spoon and take it on the right side and uh, then uh, you drink it, sip it. And then wash it again. again. So, you have to uh, you can share one, right? Yeah. So, Hari is doing his uh, PhD in. Uh, in uh, I have to register. Huh? I haven't registered so far. <laughs> so dear Alfred is gonna give you some uh, facility. Yeah. And Susan is working as a computer software engineering TC engineering model from Bike. And uh now our actual analysis is kind of uh a little special category. <laughs> So uh, the second, again, uh, uh, then take one, one uh, spoon and uh, so that this time you say Om Madhavaya Namaha. You say Om Madhavaya Namaha, take it and then and then it was again. So the third word is a take again and Om Govindaya Namaha. So uh, that's another cleaning process. It's called uh, you know, the inside as well as outside. And it's called uh, uh, manas in mind. That is, uh, mind is also the way, you know, very purified. Mind is when you think, then uh, you're always made happy, and uh, whatever you do uh, will be famous. Uh, uh, So please repeat. Om Om Apavitraha 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 Sarvavasam Sarvavasam Gato Viva Gato Viva Yasmaret Yasmaret Pundari Kaksham Pundari Kaksham Sabahaya Sabahaya Abhendraha Abhendraha Suchihi Suchihi Sri Vishnu Shri Vishnu, Shri Vishnu, Shri Vishnu. Om Om Apavitraha, Apavitraha, Pavitrava, Pavitrava, Sarvavasam, Sarvavasam, Gato Piva, Gato Piva, Yasmaram, 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 Yasmaram,
स्मरत कुंडलिकाक्षमुंडलिकाक्षमुंडलिकाक्षमुंडलिकाक्षमुंडलिकाक्षमुंडलिकाक्षमुंडलिकाक्षमुंडलिकाक्षमुंडलिकाक्षम
question that one has to meditate and also one has to uh, try to find an answer is that what is the most important duty that one has to perform in this, this moment at the time of at the moment of death. So in Pariksit Maharaj was inquiring like that to Sukadeva Goswami. So, uh, um, so Sukadeva Goswami answered this question. This answer is like this. Okay, King Parikshit, so the constant chanting, constant chanting of the holy name of the Lord, after the ways of the great authorities, is the doubtless and the fearless way of success for all, including those who are free from all material desires, those who are desirous of all material enjoyment, and also those who are self-satisfied by digital transcendental knowledge. So, the answer is, uh, in a simple, uh, simple understanding is like this, that for all classes of men, there are many different cl classes of men, some are intellectual, some are ordinary, some are just uh, happy to uh, just listen to what others are saying. So, for all classes of men, including even those who are completely free from all material desires, even for those who are who want to again for the desire of material enjoyment, 
and also those who are self-satisfied by dint of transcendental knowledge, I mean, who are self-realized, for those, for all these classes of people, the constant chanting of the holy name of the Lord, of the ways of the great authorities, is the, the fearless and the doubtless way of success for all. But this is a very clear. Um, so in other words, here, Shukadeva Swami is uh, instructing Parikshit Maharaj that uh, one must always chant this uh, uh, the Maha Mantra. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Hare, Hare So this is the, the proven uh, method of success for every class of person. So therefore this is the, the instruction given by Sukadeva Goswami to Parikshit Maharaj. And earlier, uh, in, the, in the same chapter, earlier, there is a very important verse again. Edavan Sankhya Yoga Bhyam Radharma Parnishthaya Janma Lava Parapunksham Ande Narayana Smriti So this, let's see, the highest perfection of human life achieved either by complete knowledge of matter and spirit, by practice of mystic powers, or by perfect discharge of occupation of duty, is to remember the personality of Godhead at the end of life. Ante Narayana Smriti. So to remember the personality of Godhead, or Sri Krishna, at the end of life, so that will be regarded as the perfection. Just like Prabhupada, when he departed from this planet, say, Hare Krishna. So he was, Prabhupada was chanting, Hare Krishna. Those who could all hear it, those who were nearby, uh, they could all hear it very clearly. So, so therefore, this is a, um, this is the proven method, the success for all. Ante Narayana Smriti. So therefore, if we constantly engage in chanting this Maha Mantra, when we are active, when our mind is in good shape, our body is in good shape, and our all the senses are working properly, then we can chant this Maha Mantra very nicely, and uh, not only chant, but also listen. Here, uh, this is Sarvanam Kirtan Smaranam. Sarvanam means always uh, hearing, Kirtanam is chanting, and the Smaranam Remembering, remembering. So I did say uh, among these nine processes of bhakti, these are three, 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 three processes are most important. And among them, the chanting is most important. So by doing that, uh, it is a, it is very possible that uh, but something that one does very frequently, very often, generally these are the things that will come uh, uh, automatically. It's like even if you are singing, if you are, if you are singing a song, uh, but if you sing it all the time, and generally, uh, you know, you don't have to memorize. It comes automatically. Right? You could, you might have experience <coughs> that when you say some saradava, you sing in the morning mangalarati, that since we sing every day, so what happens is that uh, uh, sometimes it seems like you might have missed one word, but actually it doesn't happen. Because what happens, it comes automatically. It says, it, it says the right, the right word comes automatically. This is a, this is an experiment that I think we all remember. Oops. Uh, we experience this all the time. So similarly, uh, something that uh, you know, we do it very often, uh, let's say chanting uh, this Maha Mantra, so generally it will come when the, when the time when that we are not able to speak properly, and uh, then you cannot express properly, but at least. You can remember it. You can remember it. Smaranam. Smaranam means remember.